What's going on guys? Welcome back. I'm gonna do a quick, quick little video. Um, so these two uh, packages are coming from, uh, this one's coming from uh, Christine Payne Towler. Uh, I believe that's her name. Um, from the Tarot of the Holy Light. And this is coming from Michael Dowers. Which uh, he did, I believe he did the collage the illustrations for, for the deck, and uh, Christine uh, wrote the book. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and open them real quick. Uh, so I'm pretty sure I know what they are because, you know, I order them, but um, this one is gonna be a deck, and this one should be uh, the art book that I ordered. And there you go. So, okay, so I, I'm i probably gonna, you know what, yeah, I'll definitely do, a, obviously, a walkthrough of this deck. Um, I had already ordered the deck um, from uh, Michael, and he accidentally sent me, uh, or Christine, I, I wasn't sure who, um, who was in charge of uh, sending and packaging things. But uh, they sent me the wrong deck, and they sent me this uh, the standard colored, um, and then this is the standard uh, black and white. So I'll, I'll definitely do a walkthrough of uh, these two plus the deluxe version. So I'll do a walk uh, comparison video of that. Okay, so I'm gonna hit it and open it. So yeah, I was saying. Um, so yeah, they sent me the wrong deck. So I contacted, oh, this one's separate. I don't know one. Hmm. Maybe it's an extra card. Um, so there you go, so it's black and white. Um, so back to what I was saying. They, uh, I was recording uh, my video, my uh, unboxing of, which I thought would be this one, but it ended up being this one. So I was like recording it and halfway through it, when, when I unboxed it, I noticed that it wasn't the um, black and white. So I'll, I'll finish that one by inserting the, by inserting this one in, uh, yeah, doing the comparison. So I'll, I'll use that clip probably for the comparison video. And these are the beautiful cards. So focus, there you go. So beautiful. Like, I love the black and white. Just look at that. Yeah. This is definitely a beautiful deck. Uh, with colored and not colored. Yeah, I just love the aesthetic, uh, the visual aesthetic of it. Um, it just looks like it just came straight out of the like an alchemical book uh, from the Middle Ages so that's really cool that's why I kind of went for this one too but it's cool and oh and uh, so I contacted uh, Christine and she said to just keep it um, and she was kind enough to um, send me the the deck that I really wanted there you go that's I think I kind of like this one a lot. I don't know. I'm definitely, the cardstock is really nice. I wonder if it's different from the other standard. No, same cardstock. Yeah, same. Yeah, I really, really love this. Um, this one's nice too, but I prefer the deluxe. Uh, but this is my second favorite. Just looks so nice without color. I feel like sometimes color can be distracting. Anyway, so there you go. Oh wait, let me uh, check. I wonder why there's an extra Queen of Cups. Yeah, because I already have the Queen of Cups here. Hmm. Interesting. Cool. Maybe that means something. 
take that into consideration and see what it means. Uh, so yeah, like the, the standard deck uh, is your typical, if you don't like big decks, I would recommend the standard uh, black or white. Um, Cause some people, I know some people have like smaller hands and they can't like shuffle bigger decks. Uh, so these are nice. The card sock is pretty nice too. It's not the like the deluxe, which is um, what do you call it? Uh, as a linen finish. I don't know if you can tell. Okay, let's go ahead and open this bad boy. Uh, it's way too big, so I don't know if I'm gonna be able to show the whole thing with my with the camera angle. As usual, I'll fast forward this. <laughs> and we are in. Oh shit, it's big. I didn't think it was gonna be this big, but it's cool, I like it. Oh, this is the front. So I think it's signed. If not, if I'm not mistaken, it's a limited print of uh, the art. I think it's called like an art book, um, and it does have. It's sort of like a guidebook as well. Um, from what I read, it um it has the all the seventy eight cards plus uh, their meaning. Um, that's really nice. Oh. Here huh? has the uh, back of the cards, all the zodiacs. There you go, so nice. So let's get the tree alive. Okay, I'm back. Sorry, um, got a call in it. Stop recording. Um, so, so yeah, it's got um, it's got the ex uh, explanation of the tree of life the yeah there's more the uh talks about the unfallen tree has uh yeah and it mentions the elements of the yeah so it just goes over the uh, tree of life which is nice and then it goes into to the key words for the miners so it separates them by suits swords wands cups and discs down here and then starts with the the key to the major arcana all over this page and then the rest of the pages are going to be the actual um, images of the card Freaking love this, uh, the, the King of Cups. Just find it hilarious. Don't you just fucking love that one? That's my favorite card in the entire deck. So yeah, it has all the, the cards and several pages and it's with the world. And it is signed by Michael and Christine. This is number 58. I have no idea. I, it is a limited print. Uh, they said it's a low limited print. So I have no idea how many uh, they have in print or how many they have left. Um, but yeah, I mean, since, since I'm such a big fan of uh, Christine and Michael, I was like, I, you know, I need it. <laughs> uh, so there you go. It's huge. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so, uh, my next video coming up will be a comparison between the standard, uh, color, standard, uh, black and white, and the deluxe edition. Okay, and that's pretty much it. Have a great day. Bye.